Hey guys, I wanted to make a quick video response to some comments I received on my Maxpedition Thermite video. And he was asking how many paperback novels fit inside the Thermite. So I had responded back, and then he wanted to know how tall the books were. So anyway, so um, FSA, we'll call you that. Um, let me put some books in here for you. So actually the ones I'm going to show you are the Kaufman Birds book. And this is 7 and 3 quarter by 4 and 3 quarter by 3 quarter inch. And also the Audubon Trees book. This thing's seven and three quarters tall by four wide by one and a quarter. So let me put these two books in there for you. Don't cut the storm collars off, people, because when you put your flap over here, there's a gap here. You want the storm collar to be just that little bit of extra protection for your goods inside. So let's put the tree book in and the bird book. Where'd that, fly, where'd that thing go? Oh, I'm lost. Close the storm collar. And it... And it readily snaps shut. Okay? So, I had mentioned that I think I can get one more book in there. Just for kicks. Okay? So here's the White Mountain Guide. I hiked um, Mount Washington, was it last summer? I think I might go back next year, 2011, do it again. I'm not going to go to the summit of Mount Washington because that's kind of boring. But there's a lot of really nice trails, and the Appalachian Mountain Club has a hut system. It's really worth looking into. It's reasonably priced and just makes hiking nicer. You know, I know you guys haul your, your tents and your bedding and all that, but it's kind of nice to hike from hut to hut and just get a hot meal when you arrive. <laughs> Especially when you have kids, you know, it just kind of makes it more fun. Um, for me anyway. All right, so this book, blah, blah. Okay, this book is seven inches by five by one. It's morning. I'm tired. Do you hear my voice? <laughs> um, let me get this thing in there. Look at that. Three books inside the Maxpedition Thermite. I think this is about three inches of depth of book there. Okay, so the Thermite is now maxed out. You can't put anything else in there. But, I, you know, interestingly... And wonderfully, this pouch is unscathed, so you could totally still keep your items in there, and they don't even get squished. Because some some packs, like when you jam it up, you lose storage capacity of other storage spaces, but not this pouch. That's nice. But the thing is, the flap now will not close. I'm going to pull this strap as high as it'll go. Now I could kind of maybe work the D ring out of this little thing here, but I don't want to just for my video. But anyway, I'm just showing you a solution. This will, like if I get it up in there, and I did get it shut, but I don't want to break this plastic buckle, and it will break under such stress. But what I wanted to show you was, and this has been on my video queue for a long time, but in my Vulture 2 video, I showed you how I made this extender out of a 2-inch SRB paracord and a cobra stitch, and I was able to extend the compression straps on the side to accommodate a water bottle. And I really, I need to make this video and show you guys how I did it. As long as you have the paracord know how to make this cobra stitch you can make it longer like for example this is a cobra stitch bracelet this is like I don't know six inches or seven or something it's a little tight for me it always was I think this is the first thing I ever made it's always just that little bit tight but um, you can make lots of things and also you can make straps for your bags which I've made as well so someday I'll show you that video but anyway so FSA if you were interested in really maximizing the thermite you could do this little extender and you could have uh, you know just really maximize your capacity and now I could even like get something in there like a little jacket or something jam it shut but I would make this probably two and a half inches because three three isn't making it drive home tight okay I think that's enough all right hope you enjoy the video take care guys